Do you need an online form builder with a cloud storage database? Well, let me show you how with JotForm. Hey, JotFormers, welcome back. I'm Kimberly. And if you're wanting to collect a lot of data or even have file uploads or securely take payments, you can do that with JotForm and have everything stored in that cloud storage database. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and scroll down just a little bit. If you need any type of templates, we have over 10,000 to choose from. But right down here, I kinda wanna focus right here. So like I mentioned, if you're collecting data, file uploads, payments, you can do that securely and it is protected by that 256-bit SSL connection. We also have GDPR compliance, CCPA compliance, and optional HIPAA compliance. Now I'm gonna head up to the top. Let's go ahead and take a look under the pricing and let's see what you get with each account. So currently on the free account, we have 100 megabytes of available space. On bronze, we have a gigabyte. On silver, 10 gigabytes. And gold, 100 gigabytes. And if you are an enterprise customer, you have unlimited storage space. So I'm gonna head up to the top. Let's go to our forms. Then over on the left, I'm gonna do create a form. We're gonna start from scratch on the classic form. And over on the left-hand side, I'm gonna go ahead and choose to add some form elements. Let's do full name, email. Let's go ahead and add in a signature as well. And we can even add in a file upload option. Perfect. Let's go ahead and preview our form. We'll do a quick fill form and we'll come down here, do a quick signature. Then I'm gonna drag in from my desktop two images. Perfect. Let's submit. All right, let's jump out of preview form. I'm gonna head up to the top. Out of form builder, I'm gonna jump over to our tables. Now, this is where all of those storage needs are going to be kept. So we have all of our information that we need from our submission. We've captured that signature, and then we have all of the file uploads available for us, and we can even download each of them here. And it really is as simple as that. If you have any questions about how to use JotForm for your cloud storage needs, let us know down below in the comments. If you like this video and you got some value, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe and turn on the bell so you get a notification every time we put out a new video. I'll see you next time.